the search for a man who robbed and raped a pregnant woman enters day three. News Channel 5's Hannah McDonald live from Antioch this morning with the latest. And Hannah, what information do police have about that suspect? Well, no one deserves to go through this, especially a pregnant woman. She is the only one who lived through this along with the suspect and police are going off of what she remembers from this traumatic event. She says that after the attack, he drove off in her car. You're going to see in the video a, a, an image of that car pulling out of the Overlook apartment complex on Wednesday. It's a 2011 dark green Toyota Camry that the victim says the attacker took. The attack robbery and rape happened Wednesday inside her home on Bell Road in Antioch. Police say the attacker waited nearly a half hour for the 30 year old pregnant woman to come home. When she came home from the store, she reported a man was standing in her breezeway and a few minutes later, he entered her apartment, grabbed a knife, robbed her and sexually assaulted her. The woman managed to hit the man with a bottle, then took the knife, cut through the screen and jumped out of her third story apartment to escape. In the process, she seriously hurt herself. It's upsetting to even think about, but police do need your help and they need you to be on the lookout for that car. Once again, a dark Camry and the Tennessee license plate on it is LP4141. Like I said, the woman had some pretty bad injuries from that fall. She was recovering in the hospital yesterday, and that's where police interviewed her. We do not know the status of her baby, but we are hoping for a good report. In Antioch, Hannah McDonald, News Channel 5.